My name is Charlotte Cleverly Bisman. She's getting bigger and bigger and we still haven't really got a free flowing in her prosthetics yet. I live in Waiheke Island. I don't want to see her confined to a wheelchair. Charlotte, you can't hide from everybody. Everyone's going to look. When I grow up, I want to be an artist and do dancing like Zumba. If there was a person over there that felt that they could fit Charlotte well, then we were going to take it. Are you um, counting the fleets, Charlotte? <laughs> for you. It was one of the hardest things I've done. That's it. That a girl. Yes, left one. Good. And the right. all our eggs in this basket and of course it really make a great difference to Charlotte's uh, walking. Charlotte had already endured 18 surgeries. How many anaesthetics do you want your child to have? I don't know how long I was in hospital. The surgery does release the tendons but she now has to learn to straighten up. Oh Charlotte, you can do this. You can do this. Why don't I be positive? Why don't I just think, well, she's alive, she's beautiful, you know. The disease didn't take her brain, she's not mentally impaired. She smiles, she laughs, I can interact with her. I mean, why doesn't that make me happy? Because the rest of it's such a fight. People say that everybody is special. I have no hands and feet and I had meningococcal. I think that is the most special thing about me.